what's going on everyone it's marcellus back with another video and we have to talk about this dip that we just now had in shiba inu and this was a pretty big dip it was all the way down to a 37 percent dip right here so yeah this was a much needed dip and honestly it, it, we really needed this dip because look right here this was so much growth we went straight up it wasn't like this where we went up sideways and we just gradually went up no we went straight up within the matter of minutes and shiba inu just kind of went crazy right there and we really needed this dip right here because uh in my previous video i mentioned about the um the consolidation that we we're going through the consolidation period with shiba inu and i said whatever we do at the end of our consolidation is either going to be for the better or for the worse so it's either going to be big or it's going to be you know it's just going to be big whatever it's going to be if we are going to jump we are going to jump huge if we are going to drop we are going to drop huge and that's where i stood with shiba inu and i still stand that way and that's exactly what we did we dropped so we broke this trend line here and uh trend lines are really easy to break with this crypto because you know the crypto is really there it's just really volatile and especially shiba inu with being such a new coin and you know it's just really volatile so yes we went on a little downtrend here and now now we are actually inside of another consolidation period after we dipped huge here so this is what our downtrend looks like but we have to think about the uh our trend line here so this is our current trend line and what we are doing here with shiba inu that was a much needed dip right there and honestly we stopped right here we stopped at right in time before we kept going down so i really do believe that the trend line is uh the downward trend line is now done and remember i'm not a financial advisor it's not financial advice it could be done it could not be done but i truly believe that this downward trend line is done but there is a reason that we dropped it didn't just drop for no reason so this is why i'm still optimistic with shiba inu but we have to look at the reason why it drops because uh, it's a really big reason. So let's go over there now. So Vitalik Buterin donates more than $60 million to, to charity after selling meme tokens, including Shiba Inu. The Ethereum creator Vitalik uh, Buterin has offloaded a range of dog themed meme tokens. The tokens were given to him, yet with the big assumption that he wouldn't sell. And as we kind of thought, he did sell. So theory creator uh vitalik Buterin sold large amounts of three meme tokens on wednesday uh let's just scroll down here and look at the important stuff so the tokens he sold was shiba inu akita inu and dojlin mars so i don't i don't know nothing about the dojlin mars and akita inu but i know about shiba inu and he said the theory behind this was that the approach was akin to burning the tokens. Presumably, the idea was that Buterin, who owns 333,000 Ethereum worth around $1.3 billion, wouldn't need the cash and wouldn't just sit on the token. And Shiba Inu's website started that the tokens sent to him were burned, stated that the uh, tokens that were sent to him were burned and that everyone has to buy the tokens on the open market as opposed to the team owning a large supply from the get-go okay Buterin appears to have had other ideas however starting a few hours ago Buterin began sending the tokens and batches to uniswap and selling them for a three ethereum he sold 660 billion shiba coins wow 660 billion shiba inu coins which comes out to 600 million dollars so well not not total but you know with everything that he sold it comes out to about that but 660 billion sheep like wow that is uh, that's crazy this is kind of this is really bad for you know sheep he knew that he sold out because he could continue to sell more because he has way more and he could sell way more if he wants so that was 660 billion i mean i don't even know what to think about this right now that's really bad i still have my money in shiba inu i watched my money go down but I still think that it'll go up in the long term but yeah this was a huge correction much needed but honestly we don't know if he's going to continue to sell so if he doesn't sell we're still going to follow this uptrend but if he continues to sell we'll follow this downtrend so watch out in the news and see if he continues to sell if you see that he's still selling then we're going to continue to go on a downtrend but if he doesn't we'll be on an uptrend and it's pretty much as simple as that i really hope that we don't you know i, I really hope that we don't just you know completely fall down to the bottom like 
This is crazy. Such dog themed meme tokens have taken off recently following Dogecoin. Common theme is that they are built around similar memes. With recent exchange listings, some of the tokens have seen their prices jump sharply. One of the tokens being Sheep Coin turning $17 into $5.9 million in under a year. That's what someone did. They turned $17 into $5.9 million. So that's crazy. Yet Bitterrand's market moves have significantly impacted the prices of the three tokens. As of the time uh, time of writing, Shiba Inu is down 30%. So that's, this is really bad for Shiba Inu. Bitterrand gives the spoils to charity. Following the sales, Bitterrand sent large amounts to Ethereum. He gave out more than 16,000 Ethereum along with some of the dog themed tokens. And he did that for charity. So it was for a good reason. But he did sell a lot, which made Shiba Inu drop hugely. Mm. Bitterin sent 500 Ethereum and 10% of his Shiba tokens. 50.6 trillion tokens to Crypto COVID, a relief fund for India. He gave, he also gave 49 trillion Akita to Ethereum focus grants. Uh, while these tokens have a paper value of $1.1 billion and $443 million respectively, they are fairly liquid illiquid for example akita could only be sold for around five million dollars on decentralized exchange uniswap he also gave 500 ethereum to charter cities which looks to support so yeah he he donated a lot of the shiba inu that he got um so let's look up his wallet so we can see how much shiba inu he actually owns now uh let's see what he owns and Shiba Inu. Okay, so this is his wallet. They're saying, uh, wow, I think this is his wallet. Let me see. Yeah, Vitalik ETH. Okay, so this is him. I guess these are all the transactions that he did. Uh, lots of different transactions. I could probably find a better website than this one. Something that has, uh, Let's see, let's see. Create a theme. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, so 8 billion Shiba Inu. Blah, blah, blah. But yeah, really, let's just uh, click off of this. We're not going to really find his wallet. I found it before, but I guess I won't find it now. But we do know that he sold a lot of Shiba Inu from his wallet and it drove the price down huge. But luckily, we stopped where we stopped and we didn't keep going. Honestly, I hope he doesn't continue to sell. But anything could happen at this point. That's a lot of money that he sold out of Shiba Inu. We definitely need some more people to buy in now. Now that he sold out, we need some more people to buy in. So then we can continue to rise in price. But with all the hype, I do believe that's possible because we still have Google Trends. You know, we're still trending on Google. We're still trending on Twitter here. Let's see where we are trending here with Google. Shiba Inu. All right, still trending here on Google Trends. Past hour, still trending huge. Still trending huge for the day. But honestly, this this was a lot of uh, market cap that we just now lost. We were at like number 15 or 16 or something like that. Now we're at number 24, rank 24 in market cap. 8.6 billion in market cap. We were at 11 billion. So, wow. That's, yeah, This we, we lost a lot of market cap, but it seems like a lot of people actually put more money into it when they seen that dip and uh yeah this is kind of bad for cheap you but i would not be scared about it because yes it did drop a lot but now if you sell you're losing money and remember in stocks and crypto you only lose money when you sell so that is something to think about but remember i'm not a financial advisor this is not financial advice and yeah you only lose money when you sell in the red and when you sell in the negative so you do not want to sell right now like do not panic sell panic sell makes you lose so much money i mean unless you really need the money like immediately and even at that you're not going to get as much money back so you're really just losing money all in all if you sell out now but i will not be selling out i watch my money go from ten thousand to five thousand and i will watch it go to five hundred dollars if i have to but i will not sell and that's just where i'm at with it but uh, i hope you all know what you are going to do and have an investment plan but this is my plan here. I'm just going over what I'm planning to do. I'm just planning to hold it. That's been my plan all along. I'm planning to hold this for actually a year. And then I'm going to take that money and do a lot of things with it. So yeah, I'm going to hold Shiba Inu for a good year. 
and then i have some investment plans with that money when i get that but yeah this is this is a good day for shiba inu for people who are buying the dip let's just say that but this is a good correction because now it gives us more space for growth because the more that he sells the more you know our shiba inu tokens aren't like concentrated and honestly i just want them to burn like half of the shiba inu tokens like they talk they talked about it shiba inu tokens burn or whatever but yeah they talk about how they want to burn the tokens but they really do need to like burn half of the supply Vitalik is dumping all his dog coins we speak he technically just donated so yeah this is all over the internet it's breaking the internet right now this guy right here um yeah so he is selling all his money you would never know this guy was a billionaire multi-billionaire if you've seen him in public you would just think he's a normal person like the rest of us and then you see him and then boom multi-billionaire doesn't have any big chains any big watches none of that flashy stuff instead he donates half of the, all of this to charity which is actually pretty good so i don't i'm not really worried about any of this but uh if you're worried about it you can go ahead and sell i'm not telling you to keep it but remember not financial advice it's not financial advice what i would say i'm not selling because i would never sell the negative i'm waiting for it to be positive and because i have diamond hands but one billion dollar donation that is huge he donated one billion dollars so instead of looking at the fact that he just sold Shiba Inu, I'd rather look at the fact that he just donated $1 billion to people who are really in need. And that's really the only thing that matters. Uh, all the people that are getting mad about him selling are people who really don't have hearts and really don't care for the well-being of other people. And I really don't care that I just watched my money go down by $5,000 because think of it like this. I just donated $5,000 to some people in India. That's how you have to look at it. However much money you lost, that's how much you just now donated. So yeah, leave it at that. Like we just now donated money to people who needed money out in India and other countries to, you know, for COVID relief and all that, you know, starving people in other countries. So do not be ashamed that you just lost money. I watched it go all the way down to $5,000. So yeah, that's $5,000 donated there. That is my good doing for uh, the year right here. But yeah, I guess he's donating our money for us here. But yeah, Shiba Inu, I definitely believe it's going to continue to go back up. I'm still bullish on it. And the price target is still 0 0.00025 because we still have more growth here. Look, we're still going up on this trend line. So it may take us a little bit to get back to where we were. But our next jump is going to be even bigger. So if this didn't happen, we were actually about to break out. So if this drop didn't happen, we were literally on the bridge of breaking out. So that's why you should definitely think twice before you sell your CB Inu because we were about to break out. That means if he doesn't continue to sell, if he just stops and you know, he doesn't continue to sell anymore, that means that we will continue to break out here. And look, we were projected to go to the moon, but we had some plans to be redirected the direction and now this is where we are at now and like i said i'm not worried not one bit about this but let me know in the comment section how much money you lost and what you think about this if you think that it's going to continue to go down or up and remember i'm not a financial advisor it's not financial advice but if you like this video go ahead and hit the like button subscribe check out the link in the description for a free stock with robin hood and weeble and crypto.com and i'll be back with another video peace